Okay, hi, welcome to uh, welcome to Quite Great TV and uh, Cambridge Unwrapped section. And um, here we are at Arthur Rank because what we're trying to do this Christmas and with all major events actually, when you've got these kind of stocking fillers, that why don't you think about giving to charity but in a practical way and showing the person that you're buying your present or Christmas item for that you really care. So we're going to go into Arthur Rank and check out, talk to Geraldine, talk to Dawn, find out things that may be perfect for Christmas and other events, just little gems that you can discover, give to charity, but in a nice way where it's all very heartfelt too. Okay, let's go. Arthur Rank Hospice is a hospice for the people of Cambridgeshire, so for the whole county. We care for thousands of people each year who are living with life-limiting illnesses. A lot of people may have heard about us because of our inpatient unit we, where we care for patients who might be nearing the end of their life, but we also have a whole host of other services. Many people might know about our hospice at home team who go out and care for people overnight. We also have services which care for people at maybe an earlier stage of their illness or condition so we have day therapy which is where patients might come along for a six or twelve week course and um, we help them with things that will help them live with their illness um, because really a lot of what we do is about that it's about helping make the most of the time that they have making the most of every moment and um, helping them to live their life to the full um, and that is something that threads through everything that we do. So what you need when you're trying to find presents for all the family is an expert. Best person to talk to is the person who's running the shop and Geraldine runs the shop along with Sarah. Sarah. And I've got my list and my pen and being a bit of a stupid man, <laughs> always get confused. So Geraldine's gonna help me get something for all the family and I mean all the family. I'm on a budget, but I do get a bit carried away sometimes. So here we go. So Geraldine, what I'm thinking is, granddad, a tie, a tie? Hi, have you got anything? I'm trying to get it for under kind of two pounds. Two pounds. Okay, yeah, let's see. Oh, now, now we're talking. Now we are talking. Well, I'm, I'm quite a, I'm quite a. Oh well, what about that or that? Well, yes, OK. I, I think, what, why don't we go for something a bit more... Look, I think, I think that. Absolutely perfect. Now, how much is that, Geraldine? One ninety. Right, so that's one present sorted. Completely sorted, that one present. And, and then we've got... We've got Dad. He's a big cyclist, Dad. He's, he's a big cyclist. He loves cycling, and we're in the city of cycling. So what do you think? Is that... Oh! Now, what is this? Now this is cycles may be stored here, only at owner's risk, crime prevention. Bit of a witty little thing, isn't it? Yes. How much is that? Yes. I wish I bought my glasses. 4 95 Could be a bit expensive for me. Have I got anything yes. cheaper? Not that I'm a skinflint or anything, but... What about the scarf? On the cycling theme, I saw some glasses round here earlier. And... Uh, yeah, look. Yes. Oh, I didn't see. Yes. Oh, they're very, very nice. nice. Yeah, very 90s. 95p, yeah, brilliant. That's good. And there's a little, there's a little cyclist on there, isn't there? That's very sweet. Yes, there. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, just, just, just there. If you just, you yeah, just there. Little cyclist there. Yeah. Fantastic. So we're going to come back for those because yeah. I don't want to move everything around at the moment. That's in nice. order to run all the services that the hospice offers in all their richness and diversity, we have to raise a huge amount of money each year. Um, so we need to secure 7.45 million on an annual basis in order to keep delivering all these wonderful services that we do. So um, to do that, we obviously have a huge amount of activity that goes on. We apply to grants and trusts for funding. We have events that happen every year. We have an amazing array of community supporters who help us with all kinds of things from golf days to bake sales and then we have corporates who might support us with lots of different activities through them as well. Some people come for volunteering, some people might, they might garden at the hospice for example, other people might actually do a fundraiser within their staff teams. And um, obviously then we also have the shops which bring in a huge amount of income. So we now have four, um, they're on Regent Street and Mill Road in Cambridge. We've got one on the High Street in Tottenham. And then we have the one here in Great Shelford. 
um, which is on Woolard's Lane. And um, yeah, there's some treats to be had in most of our shops. So um, yeah, it's a good place to come and maybe have a look for a gift for someone um, or just a special item that you might not be able to get somewhere else. So finally, Geraldine, and thanks for sparing the time because I can see you're really busy. I'm looking for a few high-end fashion items, especially for kind of... We've got some quite trendy relatives, yeah. and I want them to think that I'm spending money on them, but I don't want to spend any money on them, really. Not, not serious, much, whatever that may be. Anyway, I want to look good. Karen Millen. Karen Millen. Let's have a look. That's a nice outfit. Love that. Reese. Loads of designer stuff. Depends on what you I think I'm looking for um, I think I'm looking for Karen Millen, so that's good. Size eight. Yeah. Size eight. Don't be like that size is better, it doesn't matter. Do you, do you do you take things back? Do you do swapsies or anything? No, I'll give you credit. A credit, no, all right, good enough. Okay, well that's fantastic. Well outside of all those high-end uh, items, um, I've managed to I think get about twelve or thirteen presents for the best part of forty, forty-five pounds. Yeah but that's before we start negotiating. So if you leave us, negotiate, but seriously, get your presents, get your stocking fillers from Arthur Rank, and obviously contribute to charity while, um, while doing really nice things to your family. Make them know that you care, make them know that you've actually thought about what you're buying. And um, have a great festive time, and um, see you soon. Great.